guys welcome back to my channel so today I am doing a review video um, kind of sort of test video for you guys today I'm going to be testing the Maybelline and this is the Superstay matte ink lipstick um, I wanted to go ahead and just kind of do a quick quick eye look um, with you guys or for you guys also testing out this um, lipstick from Maybelline I seen it a couple of weeks ago and I decided to pick it up because it says super stay and I really want to see how super it is so before we begin if you are new please click that subscribe button I think it's this site click that subscribe button if you're a returning subscriber thank you for coming back if you guys want to see me do a simple look and we're going to be testing out this Maybelline Superstay uh, liquid matte lipstick just keep watching so I'm not quite sure what um, I look to do because I'm only focusing really on this lipstick so I'm going to go ahead and swatch it for you guys and I'm also going to tell you what it's claim to do okay so this lipstick is supposed to be intensely perfect perfectly intense it's supposed to last i guess up to 16 hours of saturated liquid matte um it has a unique arrow applicator for precise application and it's supposed to be available in a range of super saturated shades and that's what it claims to do um so on their website it is $9.49 for each shade but I think I paid a little bit less than that at Target um and the shade I did pick up was Vanier but I picked this one up because the other ones that I wanted they didn't have so I was like why not so I'm gonna go ahead and open it and swatch it so this is the applicator here when you do this, look at, I don't know, let me get a big, the line, the, the lipstick kind of like wants to go back into the container like it's magnetized or something. It was so weird. So I'm going to go ahead and swatch it on my hand so you guys can see the color. It's very intense. Color is really pretty. I'm going to try to do a eye look that is really simple so that the lipstick pops a lot more. So let's see what we can come up with. So I'm going to use my Tarte Pro Palette. This is kind of the palette I go to when I'm looking for a light, fresh, natural eyes.
are here to do finally. I am going to use first the NYX Lip Pencil in Cola. This is one of my favorite lip colors by NYX. As you can tell, it's very tiny. I'm going to line my lips first. <laughs> You guys already know, so let's go ahead and use it. Uh, really pretty. Wow, the pigmentation on here is really, really nice. Wow, the color is really, really pretty. It's very pigmented, like, I, it didn't take that many swatches. And sometimes when I try to do that, um, when I have some on my lower lip and I try to transfer some to my top lip, sometimes it's just like you can see through it because obviously I move some product from one lip to the next. But this one, it pretty sta it stayed pretty thick. It feels a little thick. It's already starting to dry. Okay, guys, so this is the final look. But the lipstick is really, really nice. Um, it's already dried down pretty much. It's a little bit, ugh, as you can see, it's a little bit tacky, so it's not fully dry because I added like a little bit more at the end. So I'm going to let it fully dry down and see if it actually gets fully dry. But I am going to wear it for about, I'm going to try to do as long as I possibly can today because I already ran my errands today and I am filming a bit later. It's already 6.44. So normally I would film normally I would film around 12 like 11 12 and then go by my day and then come back but I already went and did everything earlier because it's about to rain so I'm probably just going to sit in the house for a couple hours eat some food watch some Netflix edit some videos and see what happens so we're going to see how long it lasts and I'll come back and show you guys. I'm not going to reapply it. I'm not going to touch it. I want to see if it's going to last through me just wearing it, eating, drinking. I'm probably going to go somewhere because even though it's going to rain, I cannot just sit in the house. Greg is gone. He left. So I'm probably going to go somewhere. I don't know. We'll see. And I'll let you guys know what happened when I come back. Okay, guys. So it has been about five hours I think it's 10 19 right now um I haven't did anything different to the lips I haven't reapplied it um I didn't really eat a lot of stuff because I wasn't hungry but you know it passed the whole kiss test and you know bite your lips and kind of do that um and it's the color is still on but there is a little bit of transfer where it kind of came off a little bit I'm a little crackings so I'm gonna go ahead and zoom in so you guys can see my lips so it cracked just a little bit like in the center <laughs> if you guys can see but other than that the color is pretty spot on um you can probably get away with it kind of like this like I don't see any issues like so far I like it it's very comfortable to wear it's not super drying or anything like that, but it is a little tacky. Like it felt like it didn't dry down all the way. Like it's not going to just be like matte, like, you know, two pieces of paper rubbed together. So like when I do this, there's still a little bit of tackiness, just a little, which I mean, obviously it doesn't have a huge effect on the lipstick. I can't see on my top, top lip where my bottom lip touch it and it kind of fades a little bit but it doesn't have a hu huge effect um too much um trying to think what else I mean that's about it I mean the color is still vibrant it's still there and the only thing I want to test now is just like taking off the makeup wipe and see how easy it comes off so I'm going to use a makeup wipe and these are my Neutrogena makeup wipes and I'm going to see how easy this comes off Okay, that was one swipe, and it's still on there. Okay, so this is really, really on there. So I'm guessing this will not come off with just soap and water or just a wet towel. You really have to use a makeup wipe or coconut oil or some type of, like, matte lipstick um, remover. But... 
it's pretty much on there yeah that was it's pretty hard to come off as you guys can see um yeah i'm pretty i'm about i'm about to like take coconut oil to my face anyways to take my makeup off but that was pretty much it i approve this lipstick so if you guys want something that's gonna last all day um i didn't get to test it for like 16 hours but it's been five hours and it was still pretty nice i approve i like this um i give it a big thumbs up i'm gonna try to get some different shades like some and some nude shades so that i can wear them on a daily basis but i like it so thank you guys for watching and if you tried out this maybelline um super stay lipstick let me know down below in the comment section and don't forget to click and subscribe and i can't wait to see you guys in my next video bye guys